Yeah, that's it. Okay. Nice. Yes, it is, it is working now. Yeah. Okay, so, um, yeah, so hello, welcome to, the, welcome to the first of the monthly Magnetic Pie podcast series, which we're calling The Baking Tray. Because oh, I like it. Oh, well, <laughs> good, yeah, I'm, I'm good at coming up with names. <laughs> <laughs> it's a different name for every week. Week, month, oh. even, sorry. Yeah, well, this, this, this week is Apple. Uh, <laughs> no, they can trade for the Apple, it'll be the uh, ramekin next week. <laughs> <laughs> Fall, followed quickly by the saucepan. Yes. So, um, I'm, like I say, this is the first monthly podcast series. Uh, the structure of it is going to be, uh, it's, it's just sort of a trial. It might change, you know, to see how this goes. We'll have a, like, 15, 20 minutes talking about first topic this week, which is just whatever. Um, then we're going to have a mini game, which is going to be very mini this week, because... Uh, we are missing a member at the moment who seems to have dropped off the face of the earth, um, and uh, one is and, and one of us is offering backfill for somebody who also dropped out, uh, but actually provided a reason. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Amy. Um, but um, to, but this month, uh, this, uh, but then we'll have the mini game. Um, for which we have a very special prize, which will be revealed later. <laughs> and um, yes, and. Um, then after that we'll be talking a bit about Doctor Who, so we're going to try and round this out to about an hour. Um, and if Amy turns up at any point, she turns up at some point, and we're not going to restart the recording for her, sorry. No, we, we <laughs> um, if she does turn up, if just she... don't actually say anything, just have it start as if she's already there. Yeah, just like, <laughs> just, just, just jump in and you know. Um, okay, so our recipe today is going to be, well, we have a Mr. Craig, uh, have a start off with Mr. Craig, just bring the boil for five minutes. And then, uh, well, for five minutes, then panic is burnt. <laughs> panic is burnt. <laughs> you know the dinner's ready when the when the smoke alarm goes. Yeah. Uh, then after you've added Craig, dice up some Sophie, and then finally add a dash of Leroy. My pants are off. <laughs> <laughs> good That's to know. I didn't think it was that hot. <laughs> <laughs> That's good to know. <laughs> So we don't want too much Leroy. It's, it's not really a bit spicy. <laughs> just a dip. <laughs> just just depends what you dip it in. Oh. Handle with care. What are you dipping Being into? Care. What? Oh, you would. A salad dip. <laughs> a salad dip. Mm, yes. Handle with care, and then. Is and then it, just uh, a dash of Greg on top. Yeah, yeah, and then, uh, and then optional extra if you feel like it, but we're not going to add it. Is a bit of Amy. Sprinkling. Uh, Amy. <laughs> I'm saying, completely, Amy is optional. Com- completely optional. <laughs> 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 um, so, first, first topic of the day is just whatever, so anything coming up that you want to discuss, like movies, video games, because we've got Logan coming out this week. Yes, excited for that. Is that yeah. actually based on the Death of Wolverine comic story? I think it's made now based. Is it? Uh, I don't think it's the Death of Unless Wolverine. Unless it's just the, mainly the introduction of X-23, isn't it? Yeah, probably, because like, in the comics at the moment, X-23 is the current Wolverine. Yeah. yeah. Um, mm-hmm. So, you know, it, it is probably going to go off X-23, becoming... Or take you over as the new Wolverine. Um, although, to be honest, like I'm slightly disappointed. I, I'm actually, it was still, it's still tight. Like the the villain of the movie might be Dakin. I didn't ask who the villain's actually going to be for it. I think the, the, the villains are people who don't like mutants who go, who go, go around like trying to kill. The striker's back Wolverine. there. I don't think it's, I don't think it's <laughs> striker. I think it's, it's back back the, the, the rabbit, yeah. the, not the ravages, like. The, not the mar- marauders either. It's like I don't know, I don't remember what they're called <laughs> or the revenants, something like that. But um, oh, is X twenty three's in it? Professor X is in it. Wolverine's in it. Well, it's kind of, actually, that's kind of expected. I, 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 actually, Stephen Merchant is Caliban ah. as well. I think it's so. There's not many mutants left for whatever reason. Mm. Don't, it's some. Unknown apocalypse, but not apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not saying that. Really. <laughs> yeah. This is the thing with Fox, though. The, it's because it's set in the future. Mm-hmm. They've got a young girl as X-23. Yeah, we're going to have to do some more time travel stuff and yeah. I'll, I'll reset the timelines again. again. It's <laughs> yeah, because I, I think... The it, da- days of future past, again. <laughs> yeah, I think it's set in 2029. This, this time I'll actually deal with Shadowcat going back in time. Yeah. I, I actually I think days of fu- the days of future past future was set in, I think, the early 2020s or the early 2030s, something like that. Whereas... Oh, like Logan is set in 2029, which is somehow before that. But X, Professor X and Wolverine are younger in the Days of Future Past Future, mm-hmm. which could be later. It's confusing. <laughs> yeah, they've all sort of blended into one for me, to be honest. Like, oh, I'm not a huge fan of the comics, yeah. but the movies have all sort of blended. If you watch them as standalone things, yeah. they're 
they're fine. Yeah. If it's actually the problem is a bit of a mess. It's a bit confusing. Yeah. yeah. Especially when you put in last stand and everyone gets killed off for no yeah. real reason. Yeah. Yeah. Just last stand. Oh, Professor X is dead, but not really. Yeah. Um, Scarlet, we don't really have a use for him, so we'll kill him off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, universe where Juggernaut is a mutant, which is <laughs> wrong. <laughs> <laughs> And also with any Jones. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. It's not taking a look. The whole line is the whole film is going, Jagger On the Jagger bitch! Did petition to get Darren DePaul to play Jagger <laughs> Yes, I am the Jagger Nord. Bring me another. Look at that Russian IT guy. That's how you call it, Reinhardt. Where's that Darren DePaul plays Reinhardt? He just does Reinhardt's voice. Exactly, except Jug- Juggernaut isn't German, but we can, <laughs> we can pretend. I don't think Fox cares about anything like that. No. No. no, it's just details, it's details. Details, my own details. Details, details. Oh, the, the Phoenix is just Jean Grey's alternate persona instead of a cosmic entity. <laughs> Whatever, we don't care. It's about as convoluted and difficult to understand, so the audience won't be bothered. <laughs> yeah. It's because the comic books are just so all over the place, but mm-hmm. then to condense it down into movies like that. Yeah, it makes it even worse. Yeah, but I mean, they, have to think about, they have to think about the majority audience as well, yeah. who aren't as into the comics. Bollocks to the majority! <laughs> <laughs> That's where the, where the majority would be, right? That's why we left Europe. That's why Don Trump's in charge. The majority yeah. don't deserve a voice. <laughs> was, was politics actually included in the whatever? Just <laughs> <laughs> whatever, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> as far as I guess. <laughs> Maybe it's not it. politics, really. It's just removing the voice from people who don't deserve one. Mm-hmm. Is that politics? <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it's called. I think it's called dictatorship. Yeah, I think. I think. I think we're trying to. I think that's a, it's a very Doctor Doom line of thinking. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of which, will will Fox ruin Doom again? Yes. <laughs> yes. <Next question. laughs> ruined three films in a row. Which well, I think Fox ruined. Right. Right. Yes. 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 Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm supremely <laughs> disappointed about it. Like, Doctor Doom is like my favourite supervillain, <laughs> and he's not been done justice at all I mean like whatever the crash test dummy was who looks permanently shocked he looks, <laughs> he, looks, he looks like a glowy he looks like a nuclear blow up doll if you look at his face he does look like he's, he's in blowy face but with a vent <laughs> <That is hilarious. laughs> he does look he just looked like this he just looked like <laughs> but there's a vent there <laughs> Just give up a toilet better machine at two in the yeah. morning. But I, I think he actually saw the, the original concept of the Fantastic Four film in 2015, which is like the, like the Fantastic Four are already established as the Fantastic Four. And the opening scene is then fighting Mole Man. Like the thing punches a giant moloid in the face, <laughs> <laughs> which would have been great. But then um, Reed and Doom like, make a portal to the, to the negative zone or a, or a different planet or something. Um, they get lifted through like on an, on a crane instead of like teleporting pods. Right. And this crane arm would go through the portal and like set them down. And this plant's like completely desolate. And then they see like um, some ruined buildings in the um, in in the distance. And then just Galactus stands up and starts That's walking sweet. towards them. And I think he's the one that. Um, and then Doom for some reason like can't escape or whatever and Ely and the rest of the Fantastic Four like sort of leave him on the planet and he comes back later on as uh, Galactus is Herald oh, have to fight it. Doom as Galactus is Herald and then, fi- and then they find out that Doom is like just fused to the surface of this planet like he can't move he's had to make a Doombot avatar <laughs> to act as Galactus is Herald instead but that still would have been better than whatever it was that we got <laughs> It was quite similar, only... I imagine the executive ran in and said, Origin stories are popular. Make an origin story. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> Don't right. know that the, the Fantastic Four only have one villain, which is Doctor Doom. Like, but what about Ka- Kang? And I don't care. Doctor Doom! Doctor Doom! The, super <laughs> Doctor Doctor Doom. 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 the survey group likes Doctor Doom. Get him in there. We don't <laughs> know anything about him. He's a doctor. Uh, fine, just give him a needle. That'll do. <laughs> Get me. We'll, 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 we'll t- deal t- with uh, Reed Richards' surprising fear of needles. That'll do. <laughs> Oh no, not needles. <laughs> I think we have to talk about the other superhero movie that's out at the moment, which is the Lego Batman movie. 
Mm. Yeah, yeah. We went yeah, to we see that. <laughs> I, 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 I still haven't seen it. So. I, I, I have seen it. Is it, I, I thought it was incredibly good. As a I actually of really liked it. Yeah. It, 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 it. It's a Lego movie. What more? What more do you? Yeah. yeah. Well, they don't take anything seriously. It's like oh, like Lego has the rights to all of these things. Are oh, they just going to be in the movie? <laughs> it was nice <laughs> to see a, a Batman movie that wasn't just all doom and gloom, though. It yeah. was actually funny. <laughs> like, yeah. It didn't take itself too seriously. You have to say we, we, wouldn't, we haven't had one of those since the Joel Schumacher series, but they were intentionally funny. Yeah. It was, it was very aware of itself as well, I think, the Lego Batman movie. Yeah, they, I, they made I mean, so many references to the Dark Knight, Dark Knight Rises. Oh, but so also to the, like, uh, the 60s album with uh, Batman. Yes. Yeah. Shark's Yeah. 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 reference to Suicide Squad as well. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, Killer Croc goes underwater, plants a bomb. He's like, I've done something! <laughs> <laughs> no, I liked it, and I thought Zach Galifianakis did a pretty good job as the Joker. Yeah, yeah. Uh, better than Leto, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Then Leto's quite a low bar. <laughs> to I, think, I, think, uh, I think Leto could have done a good job, it. though. He is a, he is a great actor. Yeah, but... It, it was a really yeah. good inter- interpretation for a new generation, but this new generation uh, of idiots. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, Just going back to your idea that the majority shouldn't be on the voice. The majority yeah. of people are stupid. Yeah, I think it, 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 <laughs> it's so a bit from... So Shatner syndrome, where he tried to take himself too seriously yeah. and that had overacted. That was things like the base of watching, like watching Tommy Lee Jones' bloody two face. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but that he was given the wrong script, really. Yeah, it, it's, it's just it, it was overacted, and then you hear all these stories about all oh, his method acting, where he said like used condoms to the rest of the cast <laughs> or something. Yeah. I'm like, no, that's just that's just creepy. That's just wrong. <laughs> It's not, it's not something it's that's acting, like, it's I, kind I, of unnecessary. He's like, you try, I know you're trying to get in the head of the character, but in what universe does the Joker ever do that? Like, because he, he would like to. He would like to. Yeah, because he was in a dick. A classic Joker would send a, a, a box with an exploding pie on a spring, and he opened the. It turns out to have poison in it. He's <laughs> going, <laughs> Oh, this is, oh, this is bad. Not t- it's quite tasty. Oh dear. <laughs> my face is melting. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it looks like my face is melting. As well as my insides. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. No, I, I liked it. I liked it for what it was. Mm. Yeah. I, like, I it. like how, um, what's his face thingy finds? Was oh, who finds? Yeah, yeah, who finds. did he play? He was, um, he was uh, Alfred. Alfred, yeah. He was Alfred, but he wasn't Voldemort. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Eddie is ours. <laughs> Eddie is <laughs> ours. As Voldemort. <laughs> that was genius. They yeah, haven't walked into each other. Uh, yeah, I, I know. It's, it's, it's kind of like, because Ray right Fiennes played Voldemort in Harry Potter, but he doesn't play Lego Voldemort. It's kind of like how um, in the Family Guy um, Star Wars series, Carrie Fisher mm. voices Mon Mothma. So, <laughs> and Lois is Leia. <laughs> so it's Alex Forstein's Leia, and then you got Leia and one mom. And you're like, oh, okay. It's like, I hate her. They bring back all the famous famous actors as just stormtroopers. Everyone else is like, this yeah, so yeah, Dan- Daniel Craig was a stormtrooper. Mm-hmm. He he's never given a stormtrooper number. So, like on IMDb, his stormtrooper number is JB007. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because I pointed that out to you, yeah, that's, yeah, that was yeah. him, yeah. Oh, do you see that the Doesn't reveal to um, Supreme Leader Snorks is? No. Are they? Yeah. You know, um, A New Hope? Yeah. When the, the three stormtroopers are running through the door, that one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and that's how he's got that big gash. Yeah. You never forgot. Almost joined the Empire rather than the Republic. Yeah, yeah you didn't see the joke. The, like, there was loads of joke, joke ones. Like, I was like, on the second Death Star, because like, his cheeks caved in. <laughs> <laughs> the second Death Star doesn't have half of its size. So. The second Death Star was big, but I don't. Snorks isn't that big. <laughs> Any bets on there being another Starkiller base somewhere just for shits and giggles? Yeah, we'll go with another <laughs> Starkiller. Star yeah. <laughs> but bigger than no, that. Yeah, that'd be an excellent name. Yeah, yeah. yeah well, so somebody, somebody said, that wouldn't, wouldn't it have been like, better to give the, um, the Republic the planet destroying super weapon instead, instead of the bad guys? I sort of have that flipped. I would have liked to have seen mm. that. Mm. A lot, like that's one of the eclipse somewhere. Yeah, which was the um, in the original extended universe. There was another, yet another super weapon because Pal- Palpatine was obsessed with the damn things. <laughs> basically, yeah. basically, a super star destroyer with one of the lasers off the oh yeah Death Star on it, which is powerful enough to blow up continents. Yeah, huh? That's cool because that was hinted at it, um, in Rogue One, where like mm. just the flash yeah. of the power. Would just destroy a whole continent. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's cool. That was just like was it one reactor. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. 
Which I think, yeah, it does make sense. Like, it's sort of I'm, scale still, power. I'm still quite surprised that whoever is in control of the actual aim of the Death Star is actually quite a good shot. You're <laughs> taking the top of the tower off. <laughs> well, just the top. <laughs> you're, 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 he, he did say, like, Tarkin did say, aim for the facility, and he missed by a few <laughs> miles. <laughs> but to be fair, the, 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 the blast radius of it. Yeah. It's just like, oh yeah, it's going to destroy it anyway, who cares? <laughs> He's like, I can aim at the general area. <laughs> That's all you need to be in the general area. the Spin around <laughs> It's just getting a globe and throw it down. <laughs> Where do we want to destroy today? <laughs> that one. <laughs> That'll do. Australia? Nah, it's got loads of killer spiders. It'll do. They'll take do you want to know? It's a, although, someone's saying, oh, it does change like the start of a new hope because, like, you know, the ship was in the belly of, yeah. the, of another ship and, like, Vader chased it. Yeah, get on. No, you're not. I'm just seeing you. <laughs> Come on, you just saw us glass a planet and <laughs> ran off. With diplomacy. <laughs> <laughs> Just bear in mind, it was the, the Imperials' own planet, so because it was their planet, they could do what they like with it. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, that's kind of like buying a car. And say, oh, it's my car now, I'm going to throw it off a cliff. Oh, why did you do that? Oh, it's my car. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fairly sure like, some like, YouTube channels do just buy iPhones and stuff to smash them. Or yeah. to put them in microwaves, that, that's what you say. Yeah. You know, with a new update, if you put your iPhone in the microwave, it'll charge it up. I feel like yeah. that's not true. <laughs> Try it. I was like, that was like, <laughs> that was like, it charges so much it causes the battery to explode. <laughs> yeah, that was like on, on 4chan a couple of years ago. Some people did, so, so I, I convinced people that if you downloaded an app from the <laughs> yeah. Apple Store, it would make yeah. your phone waterproof. <laughs> <laughs> and so somebody like, had a proper whinge because to test it out he threw it into a river it only protects it against salt water not fresh <laughs> yeah but then there's the, the more recent one because like, the iPhone 7 doesn't have a headphone jack somebody drills just a hole <laughs> and people are like I tried this and it just broke my phone <laughs> you drilled it on the wrong side and then there was something so they had somebody put their phone, their, their phone in a microwave because apparently it hatched eggs faster on Pokemon Go. That is what I said. Oh Hold the microwave, lock <laughs> in. <laughs> it, it it I think a similar subsect of people who said, what you, what you do to hatch eggs without doing anything is just tie a string to your phone and then tie that to your ceiling fan. <laughs> 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 just remove the cat from the room. And, and, and this kid was like, it was just like, yeah, just swing, swing around and hit him in the head and gave him a concussion. David, I'm not your teacher. If he ever did that, he'd take his head off. <laughs> the phone is still being attacked. I'm very yeah. certain. I think my iPhone is smashed on my head. That'll break before I do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Must yeah, soft although hands. actually I saw a video yesterday, this, this guy, who was one like a streamer, who like, had like FIFA up or something, and you have like the sort of in, like, inset video feed of his face. And um, he was like, essentially, I think their version of loot crates on Overwatch or something, mm-hmm. and he got a pack of whatever, and he opens Ronaldo, and he's got like, Super excited! He's, oh, he's yeah, super yeah, excited. He gets up, starts. I was like, yeah. And he picks his chair up. So he's <laughs> 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 he takes it out the chair. No, he spins it. He sort of spins it around. Let's go! And it hits his TV. This big forty on inch platform <laughs> TV, and just it goes <laughs> back. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, he well, just well, stops well, up. Well, he's like. Oh shit! That's why you only wear the wrist straps. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where, where, where are the wrist straps? This, this, <laughs> this rips, wrist strap is in his tear. Stops yeah, it happens. Yeah, it stops it, stops it happening. He just didn't use his wrist strap. Yeah. <laughs> but it, it's like, it, like he goes up to the TV and he turns it round just to make sure. <laughs> that's 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 the shit he just goes like, oh, he's. He turns it a bit. He's like, "No, it's still broken." <laughs> it's definitely broken. <laughs> I love, I love video games, but I've never been that excited. Yeah, I've never been be excited enough to break something. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, accidentally. I mean, when was it? When was it? Was it the? I think it was the Christmas Overwatch thing where I open a loot crate and I get two legendaries, an epic and a rare. I was like, "Oh, sick!" <laughs> but that was it. The elbow drop monitor. <laughs> 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 I did when I did that with the legendary skins I got with the same one as Rogue Seasonal. Oh gosh. But yeah, I, was like, I thought it was funny that my mate, when he got the Halloween 
Overwatch things got like fifty crates, and he opens like in consecutive boxes. Legendary Roadhog, Legendary Roadhog, Legendary <laughs> Roadhog. That's pretty rich. Uh, that happened to me twice with the uh, Junkrat skin. <laughs> Do you know? And the, the worst part: open fifty loot boxes. Actually, no, it might have been sixty I got because I had, like a bit money left over. So yeah, all loot boxes went through all of them. Didn't get Mercy skin. Now, if Star Wars the Republic loot boxes weren't so stingy, I probably would have would have jumped with excitement if I ever got a vented lightsaber. <laughs> but they are the stingiest loot boxes you've come across because the rarest item is frequently replaced with another random drop box. Right. So it just gives you literally anything. <laughs> oh. So it can be an absolute pile of shite from every single loot box. Right. But to be fair, every time I get a loot box on Overwatch, I still go, ooh, a loot box. <laughs> yeah, even though. <laughs> silver, every silver, silver. It's always duplicates as well. Yeah. I expected nothing and then I was still disappointed. <laughs> yeah. Although I, the, the last season of it, I couldn't play much of the last seasonal event because um, I've been away in Glasgow most of the time and also upgrading my PC. Oh, yes. Um, yes. Like, I, I, my PC, it took me like four or five days to sort it out. Because I was, <laughs> well, 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 because I was only doing it in bits. After I, I was driving to Glasgow and back every day because the problem with my, expen- with my expenses, uh, I, couldn't, I, couldn't get a ho- I couldn't get a hotel because I didn't have enough money for the hotel. <laughs> so I had to drive there and back every day. I was ruined by the end of it. But yeah, um, <laughs> yeah but I, I did get like, I think I did t- I get a fo- I, I don't think, I don't think I got a photo. Like comparing my previous graphics card which I got five years ago this is the first time my PC's been upgraded in five years I've got my old graphics card which is about this big <laughs> with my new graphics card which is about that big <laughs> uh, it's about two or three times the size of it and has like its own power supply so yeah, I agree with mine and it wouldn't fit in the, the case so I get a new case then it wasn't pulling enough power so I get a new power supply the power supply was too big for the case so I get another case <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, that's just, you've seen the size of me I it's it. it's a bit of a monster. Yeah, I'll, just I'll, for the graphics card and power supply. I think it's on the Gigabyte UK uh, Facebook page. Somebody like post like, yeah, this is like his, his tower with his monitor. As he opens the side panel of his of his case and fits his monitor neatly inside. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the monitor is like this like this big, but the case is this big. Uh, he like fits the monitor like sideways into the ca- in, into the case and then shuts it. I'm like, okay, That's genius. <laughs> That's like the most impractical laptop. <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 it's, it's basically, a, a, oh, this is how you got LAN parties now. Yeah. Might take the sound off and just leave the whole thing on the oh, desk. Right. At, at that point, you might as well attach like bag straps and. <laughs> 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 a, bit, a bit like the uh, little computers designed purely for VR. They just have a backpack and put mm. a set into it and just off you go. Yeah. Oh, you could magically have done them, haven't they? It's like the all-in-one yeah. backpacks looks like a, a yeah. proton pack or something. Yeah, yeah. that's awesome. <laughs> Although actually, you see, I think it was the Alienware. We've got like this new laptop out, which like it opens up and then fold out. Oh yeah, two <laughs> the screen. <laughs> screens. Yeah. <laughs> You know, like, that looks great, but the words "gaming laptop" aren't exactly <laughs> like. Mm, it's not it don't really without its confidence. Yeah, no, because like they generally can be a, a, a bit. Yeah, I mean, I, I I got a laptop that I could game on, like. Just, years and years and years ago now i've still got it but i have not used it in several years because it like overheats really quickly is it an hp my, my i wrist, think so but it's like um i can't remember it but <laughs> yeah <laughs> it's better than i got a new computer to so start playing that so they have my laptop next to me just playing qi or something on youtube and the cat would lay herself across it <laughs> yeah, so if it's made of if it's not for sit why is it made of warm yeah. <laughs> also were you using that <laughs> Just, just don't hit the space bar otherwise I'll throw you out the door is that right? No. <laughs> oh yeah you're using laying out lie across it yeah. <laughs> at least he's just laying out the way around the other it's one like, he's following the cursor around the screen yeah, yeah. Oh, the, that is a meme that I did see of like a, a laptop up with like a cat poking around the like, <laughs> I, 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 why are you using this to look at cats that aren't me? <laughs> <laughs> it's what the internet's for isn't it? yeah, yeah. Just, just you don't do the things these cats do <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but it's like I'm trying to think what what, what, what I had there. I can't mm. remember it. But so I, computers. I was, yeah, because in ancient Egypt, cats were worshipped, worshipped as gods, and cats have never forgotten this. No, they really haven't. <laughs> genetic memory. Yeah. <laughs> it's like Assassin's Creed. They remember all the computers. I was imagining uh, uh, the earlier cats having a toe missing. <laughs> Is that film out yet? The Assassin's Creed movie. Yeah, yeah, I think it came, I think it came yeah. and went. 
Was it? Jack, yeah, it, was, it was like New Year's Day when it came out. I refused to watch it because Fassbender, but... Yeah, well, I'll, I'll be honest, like, I, 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 I just... I just an awful human being. <laughs> see, I, I didn't watch it, I've never played in, like, any of the Assassin's Creed games, mm. so I automatically just wasn't fussed, and then when I watched the trailer, I'm like, I, might, I might watch the trailer, see if it appeals to me, I'm like, I watched the trailer, and I'm like, oh, this, this isn't pulling me in at all. Mm. No, so I, I, I like, played the it. first two, and I actually mm. preferred the first... First character, Altair. Altair, yeah. yeah. he was much better than Ezio, because Ezio was just a bit too whiny. Oh, my dad <laughs> died. Good. My brother's got murdered. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Altair is just, half fine, the, get on with it. Yeah, <laughs> half, half, the, half, the character, half the characters in video games' parents have like, been killed anyway. So yeah. 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 It takes it, what's so special about you? <laughs> <laughs> get over it. Yeah. Stop murdering me. <laughs> <laughs> Who didn't even Don't look at my standards. It's a healthy way to deal with your emotions. <laughs> I can say that as a psychologist. <laughs> well, no, I think. What's the best way to deal with people as a psychologist? Is it just throwing them out the windows? Fire. Or curb stomping them? Or fire? <laughs> I feel like I shouldn't comment. Don't give me a trade I'm sorry, but. Um, in general, as a psychologist, <laughs> the best way to deal with your emotions not going out and murdering. Great, <laughs> <laughs> so we've got a pen. <laughs> do not, not go out and murder me. Go away. Yeah. Oh. Do do? That's what the um, the church guy outside was saying was. What, don't go out and murder people? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, I'll go to hell. <laughs> so I just told, told him Satan loves him. Yeah, leave Leroy alone for a few minutes. And I came out of the metro station and he was talking to. I don't know what type of branch of Christianity they were City from. of God. From City of God. City of yeah. like a cult. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I have the pamphlets here, actually. It might be. I can tell you. Man, man, I keep seeing a couple of Jehovah's Witnesses. Go, you're you're actually going, in a while. You're actually I think I'm better right. with him. So I think I'd rather hurt his is belief. Is it, is it, but I'd rather crippled his belief. I think it's the city of God, like sort of like Los Angeles, which is which is which transla- it's Los Angeles yeah. translates to the city of angels. Yeah. So. Now, if you're God, <laughs> see, I learned that from the episode of Captain Scarlet. <laughs> <laughs> if you're God, you have an infinite number of planets in the entire universe. Why do you need a city? Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's, a, it is a local church for saying, uh, people uh, like you. Yeah, and it's kind of like no no man's sky really. There's an infinite yeah. amount of people. Why concentrate on one planet? Because mm. let's be honest, you're not going to see the other million. It's not like focusing on one planet is going to find anything in any way. Yeah, the all the mineral. Uh, I'm gone now. <laughs> so all, all, gone. All, I, all I'm going to say is, no man's sky was a hot mess. <laughs> Make of yeah. that what you will. Well, yeah, well, I, I think um, I was watching Yahtzee uh, review it, and he's like, "Oh, basically, like, the problem with no man's sky, and the problem with like an infinite amount of possibilities in a sandbox game." an infinite amount of directions which to go is that let's let's be honest there's like you're never going to see all of it so you're, like you're never going to get anywhere near what could be called completionist status mm. it's, it's going to take you however many billions of years to visit every planet and you won't find Why anything bother? Of yeah, interest. you do kind of end up a bit well what's the point yeah. You spend all this time just find, trying to find a rock that's shaped like a cock. Yeah. <laughs> right, I which, 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 you can, which, which you can see anyway if you just log on to Minecraft. Uh, True. Just, just on any 13 year old Minecraft page, there's some <laughs> giant cock and balls made out of gold. It's either yeah, that or I start build, really. building my own random tower in the middle somewhere, someone will mistake it for a cock until it puts me on the top. Yeah. Yahtzee didn't care for Last Guardian either, but I really liked it. No, well, I haven't finished it. Class person. I rented it, played it for about 10 minutes, got fed up and sent it back. It's stressful, it stresses me out. You're vandalising that camp. I'm modifying it. <laughs> Modif- <laughs> You're improving it, are you? I am coming back again soon, Jesus. So I'm going to say, I'm coming in your butt soon. <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm coming back and so, so, so it sounds like, you know, if you not keep your payments with the Mafia. Jesus, back! Break this! Break your legs, <laughs> I'll be back soon. <laughs> He's always died for his sins, it's fine. <laughs> yeah. I've he come back like... to die for your sins again, because <laughs> Jesus Christ, your sins! <laughs> so bad that I didn't even know my own name in vain! It's like, what was it? Um, Facebook, uh, a Satan Facebook page or something where he's like, um, oh, like one, if one sin gets you sent down to hell, why stop at one, commit a million sins and come down exactly. to your legend? Exactly. Genocide, eugenics, <laughs> everything. Yeah. All right, so, the question some of y'all believe me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't... Right, it's truth. You don't have to believe in it. What's in? Lost track. We're going to about half an hour point now, so let's uh, m- start m- moving on. So move on to the next five minutes section, which is going to be the game. Uh, now, oh, so, speaking of which, I just lost the game. 
No, oh, you, you dick. Yeah. But, okay, <laughs> someone's gonna say. Yeah. It. So for the people watching, keep him hidden, hidden, sort of hidden for now. So for the people, I say people watching, who's like, who, like who's it's, not, yeah, it's gonna look like we'll do a podcast. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, no, me face for radio. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so the, the the game this week or this month was, uh, well, I, I I call it Donald Clock. Um, <laughs> I did. I didn't prepare a funky soundbite with a chicken noise, but. Um, da, 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 da. <laughs> right. right, right, Donald Cluck. <laughs> it's, yeah. yeah, it's called Don, Donald Cluck. I, if people listening want to play this, they, they, they can play this if well, they want. But it might win. It would be rather pointless. <laughs> yeah, we yeah, yeah, won. You have to pause <laughs> right now yeah. so you can actually do you, it. You won't win prizes. It's fine, <laughs> but. Um, Basically, I uh, tasked them to uh, draw an animal in cosplay. So I gave them a few rules, like had to be their own work. Uh, the animal, if, it, if it's cosplaying a character that is based off an animal like Bugs Bunny, can't be the same animal. So you can't have a <laughs> rabbit as Bugs Bunny or a duck as Daffy Duck. What if it was a rabbit wearing Bugs Bunny's skin? <laughs> I don't think that's cosplay. No, that's <laughs> not, that's <laughs> that would not, <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't that be alternate universe Elmer Fudd? <laughs> <laughs> Should have done that. Bugs Bunny dressed up as Arnold Fudd. Yeah. Nah, I'm hunting rabbits. I'm hunting hunters. Oh, it's funny. Like um, the Mel Blanc like didn't like carrots, but he had to bite, yeah. but he had to bite a carrot to make the carrot, carrot the carrot sound. We couldn't get the Foley out artist yeah. to do it because he hated carrots even more. Yeah. But you're also going to give your character a, a, a name. A, a, a funny name is not compulsory, but highly encouraged. <laughs> I'm not funny, so I didn't. Yeah. Well, let's let's, let's, see, the, let's, let's just see the prize that we're playing for today. It is a, a plushy Mario coin. Ooh. Holy Ooh. hell. Ooh. <laughs> that, hold on, just a moment. Uh, that has a very special feature. Is it real money? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's legal to If you hit it, it makes noise. Well, I wish I put more effort this now. <laughs> yeah. Did you put more than five minutes work into it? I mean, it's, pretty much. Yeah. Then you did more than me. <laughs> yeah, the, the, guy, the, guy, the guy who sold me this was so glad to get rid of it. What a hand for Sony fan. No, because he, 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 he didn't realise he could turn it off. <laughs> like, people, kids would come into the store and they'd pick it up and just go... <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Where was it from? Game. Sweet. And, um, we did Adam Sanders. No, this was <laughs> game, game in Glasgow. Uh, uh, until, Adam. <laughs> but um, the better game. You, you've been flirting with other game stars. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Adam. It, we've got it on tape, folks. <laughs> you heard it. Yeah, here, yeah. <laughs> but, but we also said that they used to have a plushy warp pipe as well that also made noise. But people liked to turn it upside down so it looked like a top hat and put it. <laughs> <laughs> to make, to put it on and make the noise of Mario going down the pipe. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, this is why I hate people. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what so the guy in the store said, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it but he was, he was so glad to get rid of it. He's like, please take it. I will you, pay you to take it away. <laughs> I, I wish. <laughs> but yes, so uh, we're we'll going age order. So, uh, youngest first, Leroy. Hello. What, what, so, so, introduce your character and show us. So, I like jetpacks. Okay. I like helmets. And I like dogs. So I made the puppeteer based on the rocketeer. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Jack Russell fighting <laughs> Matisse. <laughs> it's a tail off. It's a jet pack helmet. I thought he's done... I'm close, I don't know. 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 I'm close, yeah, I can draw feet. So I can draw feet, so I give him really bad new balance. <laughs> uh, yeah, now he's only got two legs. <laughs> it's the angle. It's the angle. Yeah, yeah. it's the angle. It's, the it's angle. very symmetrical. Yeah. yeah so he's... there we have the. Does look like he is a, is a happy dog as well. Yeah. Puppeteer. I like it. Yeah. I like the streamlined like... design of the helmet. It's yeah, well you. thought out. Yeah, yeah, nice. When there will be pictures up, up of this later after release, so I get photos. Yeah, so you long, need to look I wonder how long the dog will, it'll take for the dog to realise that having its mouth wide open is a massive air break. <laughs> <laughs> it's just slowing down. Yeah, yeah. But but I'm just like, waiting for the uh, bug spatter on the uh, <laughs> on the front wing. Three snacks. 
He needs a little bandage or something on his tail, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's going to be no, good. Every time he flies, he's to change it. He just, he just sore. Oh, the bandage just burnt it. off. Yeah. Fire. <laughs> he, he, bandages are flammable, contrary to popular belief. <laughs> that is true. I feel like I should know this. But you, you, you made your psychology yeah, not so Why would a psychologist Well, I'm a doctor. Not, so I'm a psychologist. Not, 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 not that kind of doctor. Not a useful kind. <laughs> Damn, I'm a doctor, not a sort of doctor. So just, just like uh, Genji going, Mer- Mercy, I have a rash. I'm not that kind of doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I will not rub cream on you. <laughs> Get away from Not me. again. Not the last time. Fell <laughs> for that once. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so uh, Craig, let's see, let's see what your yeah, I mean, Leroy, sorry, doodle is. The Next day, came, uh, came with an idea whilst playing Final Fantasy XIV. First idea I had was Cloud Squawk, which is too <laughs> obvious to me. So, so instead I came with Kufka. <laughs> it's a cat. It's a moogle. Oh, it's a moogle, it's right. A yeah, it's oh, a you, you did ask if uh, fictional characters were like, uh, yeah, fictional, yeah, that's that. So, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about in seen. five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> did Cloud Squawk chock about yeah, Cloud? I thought, yeah. oh, do one of these two ideas. No. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, I don't know much about Final Fantasy. <laughs> I've, not played, I've not played much, but what, what one of my friends has. So, uh, Kufka's I, I, the villain from Final Fantasy VI. Okay. Kefka, even sorry, Kufka. Kufka, <laughs> Kufka. <laughs> it's the move. The you should move do all these five minutes on this. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it seems to be a, f- a fair amount of detail, it? so it's got hair and eyes. <laughs> all, all things that make Maybe. a character a character. <laughs> it's definitely eyes. in Google. <laughs> yeah, so I'll have to br- bring up a, uh, what do you call it? Um, picture. A coin. Oh, I'll pick the scene, like, compare mm. la- la- later on. So I'll do like yes, a do it side by side comparison. You can say just how <laughs> shit my drawing skills are in comparison. <laughs> I don't know, like. <laughs> yeah, that foot kind of looks like a. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I just think, is that, ne- is that an extra elbow there? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> 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 like I can put that. Do, do dogs have elbows or knees? Well, they have the. the um, if in doubt, and it's the, the ankle is further up, that's why they run really fast. Mm. So, science, bitches. <laughs> yeah, they essentially have long feet. Yes, um, long, that, long that's his foot there. So I should have drawn the shoe there. Yeah, yeah, like, like you've done in the back, but not the front. <laughs> but it does just look like a little, a little, little booty. You see, like yeah. some people like dra- dress dress their dogs to be like little, little booties. And little, <laughs> although I like, say that I did actually a couple of years ago now. I saw somebody walking through the centre of Newcastle with a pram, and in the pram were no less than like nine chihuahuas. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 the chihuahuas pulling it. <laughs> no, they were inside the pram. <laughs> 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 I was imagining how like she like the woman is sat in the pram and there's like nine chihuahuas that loose like forward my dog army. Did she know that the chihuahuas were in the pram? <laughs> I'm fairly sure. Like, where's my baby? Where's my child? <laughs> I know my child has turned into dogs. <laughs> At home in the dog. Oh, no, 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 do we yeah, have to like have a, a Who's coin up for it? Just the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Ghost of Amy is speaking to us. <laughs> What's that? You just half an hour then apparently. Yeah, oh, I think it was just a book sale. Yeah, fair enough. Oh. I think it was a book sale. Yeah, I thought it was a book sale. Oh, yes. How many Tardis come down and buy a book? Yeah. Yesterday. Yeah, this is a difficult choice. So, look. Oh, 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 you're bribing me, you're bribing me! He's handy, 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 he's I forgot to say, I can't, can't, even, can't even Google. So I'm just going to have a look at Craig's. Every time I Google something, I've got to like press my email address. Oh, hold on. That, that, that's, that's not, I don't think that's a Kafka. No. No. That's a character's Kafka. Oh, Kafka, oh. not Kafka. Okay, so you, okay, so right, you've. 
<laughs> that, that might be why I've come with weird images of like somebody's wedding day. <laughs> um, that right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So it look, looks like Pi. It looks a bit like Piedmon from Digimon. He does a bit. Yeah. Yeah. So. Oh, it's got, got got the rough. It's got what got the the big, the big scarf and the uh, 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 dress. And got his little clown shoes. Big smile got, as well. Got a little bit there. Big sm- Big smile. <laughs> big smile. Got the got the wings. W- wings and put Sophie's wings a bit to shame. That reminds me of the next about the movable yeah. wings on. My wings are sharp enough to cut them out. Sharp enough to cut them out. Got little scarves. Uh, oh. Uh, that's pretty good. And let's see what a, what a Moogle looks like. It just looks like a, a, a okay. That maybe made the wrong choice to doing something in Final Fantasy base for someone who's not doesn't. Oh, you, you <laughs> didn't know that I've not played Final Fantasy. It's got it's got it's got the little Moogle bobbly bit on top. Mm-hmm. Got, got the nose. Uh, uh, got the nose. Doesn't do you have the does it have the wings? We'll know. say yes. The wings are hiding yeah, in the back. 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 That's, that's where wings are traditionally located. Yeah. <laughs> Unless that's your Namor who's got wings on his ankles. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like to have them on your chest. <laughs> you lie down, like, just, just, just lie down and float <laughs> away. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Thor has wings on his helmet. Yeah. So he's, no, come back, helmet. <laughs> How does that feel? This is not a You see, 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 see it flying with some geese along with the. <laughs> Along along the wing chest from Star vs. the Forces of Evil. (laughs) Just fly outside with some geese, like migrating to to Africa for the winter. Here we are, watching the fashion fashion migration. (laughs) All these clothes, wings on, just (laughs) fucking off. (laughs) Here's another the the Rocketeer, Rocketeer. Let's check out the helmet, helmet is good. Absolutely. See, the jetpack is based more on the um, the movie version rather than the comic book version. Yeah, well, look, well, look, I saw it's pretty similar to that comic <laughs> the book The helmet's version. the most important <laughs> bit, really. <laughs> yeah, helmet's the most important bit. Does he have a gun? No. It's in his butt. Because he doesn't have it's a dog, he hasn't got pockets. And thumbs. He doesn't have a mouth. He's on a man who carries his gun in his mouth. Actually, is that what that is? That's not his tongue. That's his that's, yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> gas. He's just like... <laughs> he shoots things gangster style. <laughs> yes. Gangster style. Does he shoot like, like L with his little finger? <laughs> it's British gangster style. He's with his little finger out. It's how I drink tea as well as shoot my police. <laughs> that's that's right. Just in capital. No, like no British gangster style would be with a knife. Who? <laughs> rather, than, rather than a gun. Have more, more of those. Go some people go with nunchucks instead, since they got banned for a while. <laughs> nunchucks. Oh, well, every it, dangerous weapon in the world. Nunchucks. They're <laughs> the ones we must ban. I was going to say the, the more dangerous to yourselves. I mean, you see how yeah. many nunchuck videos get to you being framed. There's somebody hitting themselves in the chat. <laughs> mm, I've, I've done that before. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> Would not do again. Mm. No. Yeah. No. Ge- generally, people who get hit in the chap don't like being hit in the chap any yeah. time after. I, I have nothing to contribute to that. Concept. No. It hurts more than childbirth. <laughs> now I have many. I actually have never given it. Exactly. So, but I yeah. told it it stings a bit. It stings <laughs> a bit. <laughs> it's smart. Smart. Just for a little bit. <laughs> it stings a bit. Followed yeah. by very lack of sleep for a while. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 it's like, oh, I, oh, the, you know, I'll answer a question what hurts more, being kicked in the nuts or being. Or giving birth. Uh, the answer is simple. Like after a woman's given birth, she wants another kid twelve months later. But if you kick a lad in his wedding vegetables, he's not actually going to. He's not going to have to be like, "Oh God, do that again." <laughs> yeah, he's not going to have to be kicked to be kicked in the in in, in the veg again. So mm. I feel like we've gone off on a tangent. Here. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> so, of some description. Yes, yeah, so it, it is a bit, it is a bit of a difficult decision, mm. but uh, I, th- I, th- I think uh, we might have to give this to Leroy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that Leroy's also combined a meme in the name. Yeah, yeah this is a meme I'll take. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so collect, collect your prize. Thank you very much. Nice, nice coin. <laughs> you should I'm know. myself it. now because that's all I'm going to hear for the rest of the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it can't, it can't yeah. be turned off. You're welcome. <laughs> no cards. That's the guy in the store. Yeah, imagine oh, the battery will run out eventually. Yeah, the battery will run out eventually in about four years. Oh, <laughs> is, is the next prize going to be a, one of the Toriel dolls which has a little heart inside it? You're just going to cut her open and pull it out. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be in the uh, Mario operation. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, what, 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 take out the mushroom instead. It's a one-up mushroom instead of a heart. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, thank you for that. I feel like they deserve a victor. Um, I'd like to thank Amy for not being here. Maybe <laughs> 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 to make the conversation slightly easier. <laughs> yeah, it's a two-horse race instead of a three. Yeah. Oh, also, Jared for dropping out for the, you know. Rather than yes, <laughs> dropping Sophie out at the last minute. Thank you very much. Yeah, who did, did not have enough time to prepare for for this, unfortunately. I'll, I'll make up for it. I'll, I'll draw something to put on Facebook. <laughs> okay. We'll, we'll make up for it, but unfortunately, no prize. <laughs> but there will be a clear winner, and it will be me. Mm. <laughs> all, all the whoever the, uh, the viewers decide go, go on viewers comment yeah. tell us who you think wins yes <laughs> yes uh, if, if you do want to if, join if, if you say puppeteer the, the puppeteer then Kufka will come for you and destroy <laughs> your world and poison your water supplies and everything the puppeteer will fly over him and shit on him <laughs> I, I don't so, know what I'm going to do yet but as if something you, as if you don't <laughs> <laughs> send Amy for them I give it to so Maybe that's uh, where Amy is. She's gone to find them. <laughs> yes. <laughs> going to destroy Sophie's enemies. I'll pass that on to you so we can okay, yes. that. Yeah. We'll take photos. And um, I promise I will let this victory and power go to my head. He okay. almost certainly will. I can guarantee that. Yeah. <laughs> this victory over one person who can't draw. <laughs> Not um, for well, someone you can't draw. That's a pretty, pretty decent, decent, pretty, pretty decent <laughs> drawing. So, but if, but if, you, if, you, if you, the people who are listening, if you do want to join in at all, um, then um, just you know, any art form is acceptable. Um, so you can do collage, you know, like cut things out of magazines and draw things and stick them together and you know. Expressive um, dance. <laughs> unfortunately, <laughs> slam poetry. Mess up your pets. <laughs> you just dress your pet, take a photo. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you can dress your pet up as a puppeteer easily. Yeah. Watch out for the tail though. Yeah, don't set the tail off. <laughs> don't, yeah, don't set the tail off. You don't really need to go so far to have a working jetpack. <laughs> A working jetpack is not necessary, but hilarious. <laughs> you better not see your dog after, though. No. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so the ne- next topic will be Doctor Who, the next Who? 15, 20 minutes or so. So, uh, Doctor Who with the new Doctor coming up. Not yet announced. Tilda Swinton is apparently high, high billing for succession of Peter Capaldi. I think she'd be great, but it's a bit of a big guess for BBC and a bit of a commitment for her. No, that's yeah, that's been yeah. one of the things I've been thinking about. Tilda's a relatively Biggish actor. Yeah, she's There's, a big name. I mean, a lot of the time when they bring in a doctor, they're not they're not a small name. They're not exactly a massive name yeah. either. Well, I think undoubtedly, um, like Tilda Swinton would be good for the role. I mean, just look at her in Doctor Strange mm. and Chronicles of Narnia, and you see, mm-hmm. like, oh, she's got the right. She definitely can have the right air of sort of alien mm-hmm. mysticism about her. Mm-hmm. But um, obviously, there's a lot of problems coming with, especially casting a female doctor as well. Is, uh, is it's a very it's a very problem over it, casting a female doctor is uh, over say uh, a different J- James Bond yeah because Doctor Who's kind of built around the idea it's a different character can be a yeah. different character that's yeah. played differently yeah I think, but it's I a think, very split I think we're topic. ready for a female doctor yeah, yeah. Um, Joanne Lovely yeah. we've had yeah. technically we're, we're, one yeah. also I, I admittedly for about, what all five minutes of that yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, admittedly I, I'm sort of a very much a fence sitter on this because like as much as I wouldn't mind it happening, it just has to sort of like the circumstances have to be right. And right at the right now, it feels like it's going to be forced since Moffat's been sort of like pushing for it, you know, especially mm. with the with Dr. Clara in the last <laughs> series and um, with the general regenerating back from a male into a female, um, yep. but, that, that, but the, 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 and also the master as well. Um, in, That's true. It, yeah. it, 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 it's all seeming very pushed and very forced, and it doesn't really feel like it's happening organically. It feels like it's how, happening. How is it going to happen organically? Then is a good question. Mm-hmm. Well, the thing is, like with transgender regeneration, we don't really know much about it, and it hasn't really been explained a huge amount. But like, I have put a, 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 an excessive amount of thought into it. <laughs> like, <laughs> some, 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 some might say too much. But, <laughs> Um, just trying to sort of rationalise it, like, you know, like it, it, would this work, you know, and would, um, like, how could we, sort of, like, how, how would it work? Because obviously you've got to try and withstand the laws of nature and stuff. Because it, it, in the... No, it's Doctor Who, it doesn't have to. Yeah, well, no, Doctor Who never makes sense. sense. Yeah, but <laughs> like, um, to come I'm to it, has, it has to make, it sort of has to make some kind of sense and sort of be grounded in reality to be... But I think we're talking Doctor the, Who. But I know we're talking water, Doctor, so Doctor Who. Doctor Who had a dinosaur wandering around Victorian London for no particular reason. <laughs> True, but you've got, to be cert- you've got to play by certain rules generally. Um, otherwise, it's just not. Like, you got to, why implement this rule if you're then going to break it in the next breath? 
Like the 30 yeah. new generations. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah, we, 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 like that. Yeah, yeah technically. We already uh, had the 13th video. Yeah, well, one said yeah, yeah, well, well, yeah, yeah, the Time Lords came through and gave him his new ge- regenerations. Yeah, yeah. So they get the 13th now, right? And now he's yeah. keeping yeah. on the painting for no particular reason. Yeah, you see, that, that, that idea was sort of like floated back in the 80s, I think, with the 20th anniversary with Peter Davison. Yeah, and there was... Um, the Master was offered a whole new cycle of regenerations by the Time Lord. So the ideas existed for a long time. Mm-hmm. And there was something in the Sarah Jane Chronicles when um, David Tennant was in. It's like, so how many times can you do this? Mm-hmm. And you just pull out a random number, like hundreds or thousands yeah. of times mm-hmm. you can do it. Yeah. So, oh, that was Matt Smith, actually. I think. Was this? Yeah. Oh. No one, I can't remember his stupid face. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, like, um, but I feel like they have already tested the waters with it because... The master and yeah. mistress, and that mm. kind of worked. I really liked yeah. her as the mistress. Oh, she was. She was yeah, she came yeah. back this series mm. as well, um, and I'm sort of glad we got the master back as a uh, sort of recurring villain yeah. again. I like loved did. Yeah, like yeah. human evil over there, yeah. or, a, or yeah, or a sort of constant foil, more or less. Mm. Yeah, but um, the thing, the, the thing was like obviously, my opinion was very much split, and obviously we don't know how it's happened or whatever, but. I, I've I've got a, a, a couple of reasons to sort of rationalise how like it can happen, mm. if at all it does happen naturally. Well, first of all, like obviously like, like in our like actual society, we have like obviously people who can be transsexual and like change from male to female and vice versa. Similar could be done with time lords, where like by <laughs> sur- surgical guidance, say I I like, go, I want to regenerate as a woman, or it's, I want to regenerate that, as a so man. The current incarnation has himself changed over, then the regenerate come back to the original gender just to mm. piss them off. Yeah, because like um, the thing was like I think in an ep- the first episode with the master in in um, David with David Tennant, he when he said something about the doctor having a, a biological code or something, mm. which. In my mind, there's like a core string of DNA in each time order that doesn't change at all throughout each regeneration. So then, like, you know, I, I sort of identify a time lord throughout all, all their incarnations. But that's shown in his um, in his grave as well, isn't it? When they find that, and when Clara jumps yeah. into that. Yeah, I think mm-hmm. so. Because I think it's just more of an essence. It doesn't have to be a gender. It doesn't have to be a personality. It's just right then a yeah. core yeah. essence. Yeah, so, so the type so of person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There, was, there was something mentioned before where um, the Time Lords can control their regeneration. Mm. They could come back yeah. with two heads if they wanted. I think to, to some extent, I think they can, but like. Because so David Tennant did regenerate into himself. Yeah. When um, he was shot by the Dalek. Yeah. He did regenerate into himself, so. Yeah, he, 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 he did. trying to make sure he's not ginger for a while now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I personally would like to see a female doctor, and I think. Tilda Swinton would be brilliant. Yeah, yeah. I think when it comes down to it, Hayley Atwell wants, wants to be the Doctor oh, yeah, as well. Be That'd be cool, yeah. yeah. That was an mm. interesting one. I think Emma Watson's name was floated around as well. Yeah, I like, think she's like, due out there yeah. the yeah. for that. But then yeah. again, so, so is Hayley Atwell and uh, Tilda Swinton, if yeah. you think about yeah. it. I see Daniel Radcliffe has <laughs> also been floating around as well. He said that he doesn't want to be the Doctor because he's, mm. he feels like Harry, being Harry Potter, like one iconic role yeah. is enough for him. He doesn't want mm. to have, like, mm. have two. And Please. people wouldn't be able to see past the Harry Potter thing. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I so kind of big. struggle when I watch Daniel, even though I'm not, I'm not a huge Harry Potter fan, but I struggle not to see Harry Potter when I see Daniel Radcliffe mm. in mm. and stuff. Like yeah. when I watch The Woman in Black, you kind of still expect him to just pull out a wand and be like, yeah. no ghosts! Harry, Kill me! Harry Potter fans! <laughs> Harry Potter fans! I'm not a Harry Potter fan! <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming that yeah. there is a Harry Potter Harry Potter in The Woman in Black. A go, <laughs> ghost go away still. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I actually, I actually think, I think um, a name that has also been floating around this time is Chiwetel Ejiofor. Mm. Mm. Who was Mordo in Doctor Strange. Oh, yeah. Uh, right. Um, because he, he's been on the last couple of lists, I think. Uh, and I'm like, yeah, he, he could work. But a name that has been floating around most lists previously that I've not seen mentioned at all this time is Patterson Joseph. Uh, Joggy Henry? Uh, well, he, you know the episode of Doctor Who, uh, uh, Chris Reckleston with the Dalek's weakest link? Yes. <laughs> yeah, he was the black guy in the weakest link. Ah, mm. uh, right. That's uh, a long time ago. It is a long time ago, but his name has been floating around on a few lists like, for quite a, mm. quite a while. For every before. single time that James the Actor's in. Pretty basically. much. Actually, another actor I've, seen, I've not seen on lists lately is James Nesbitt. Mm. That, that's a possibility, though, since um, both Peter Capaldi and... Um, yeah, James Nesbitt's Irish. A yeah, few, few, few of them who came back with more permanent roles had also yeah. had minor ones beforehand. Yeah, yeah. yeah. J- 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 James Nesbitt's Irish, and like the Doctor Who actors have all either been English or Scottish. Mm. 
Um, I don't think it's been a Welsh doctor yet. A Welsh or Northern Irish one, would actually I don't think it's I don't think it's been an Irish doctor <laughs> With yet. <subtitles>. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, 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 the Welsh one would be perfect, and then I keep going back to quarries again. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so at home. <laughs> but I, I really don't care, like, in the stage, like, yeah, the, I feel like the it doctors, shouldn't make a difference. The doctor's can... gender is mm. the same as the doctor's race or nationality it's, it should be fluid, yeah, it's it's fluid, fluid character. Character. to me it's, it's all about telling a story yeah yeah and the only thing holding that back now is Moffat Moffat yeah I've never liked him as a showrunner yeah no he's good like, he's good he's good as an act as a writer for like single stories but I don't think he's decent as mm-hmm. a showrunner yeah like I was like, saying before we started Blink one of my favorite episodes yeah Blink and The Empty Child mm-hmm. um what else has he done oh is Amy speaking again Oh, Something yeah. about Love and Clara again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, her favourite companion. Yeah, since Amy's not here, I will, for her, vouch for how good Clara is. <laughs> I, will, I will fight her corner for this, and she will appreciate it. You, you don't know my sister. I think I can hear some screaming already. We can well, just see a dust cloud on the horizon. <laughs> <laughs> Amy running towards us. <laughs> just, just so I'm not doing it! Curtain. <laughs> the curtain line. <laughs> it's like, I'm not dead, but you will be in a minute, Leroy. Oh, yes. I can. I fully agree with her. I, I hated Clara as well. <laughs> Not with the same fiery burning passion, but yeah, I, like, I hated her as well. Yeah, some people like liked Clara, but like it's mainly because people were like, oh, Jenna Coleman ain't bad, is she? <laughs> it wasn't even that. But, I just I think there was bigger problems in that series. Yeah, like generally the writing, like, like I say, yeah. saying, like generally like because the, there was two parts of the last series, like set up, brilliant, and then follow up. Uh, kind so, of. So, so well, was, 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 oh shit! We have to end it, don't we? Yeah, like the, um, the, yeah. That was a, <laughs> yeah. So the only exception I think was the um, Zygon episodes. Was the Zygon two part was just solid all the way through. Yeah, I was a, I was a fan of that. But yes, yeah, I still it was. I was still like the the, the, the the one hander followed immediately by the series finale that dropped the ball like massively. We're like. Uh, like oh my god, time on time on, and then like oh, they've featured like ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it's had a fundamental problem since the change the format from Easter special series Christmas special. Mm-hmm. But since um, Matt Smith, not Matt Smith, Stephen Moffat yeah. changed it, uh, splitting the seasons, then maybe just having a special wait in a year, doing another half a season Christmas special, then just split it up like that. It just it lost its stride. It lost its yeah, pace. Yeah, it did because um, it, it, it's like you, it, you need like the whole series in one in one go, really. Mm. Rather for than, something like that, where you yeah, I think the, the reason they gave for not actually doing a series last year was like oh, because there's like plenty plenty going on this year. It was what like a football thing. There was the Olympics. There was plenty. Like, oh, there's too much, too too many things happening. Like Doctor Who's not really going to be a standard. How many Doctor Who fans are going to be like? Yeah. Oh if yes. If you draw a Venn diagram, <laughs> people who give a shit about the Olympics. And this is this is not saying anything against Doctor Who fans because no. I personally couldn't give a shit about sports. <laughs> Unless I'm like making speed games in the gym. Um, yeah, is that but that's famous there's, sport there's just lifting things. Yeah, heavy things make them a bit higher. That, 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 that's work for me. <laughs> <laughs> But no, like, uh, I really couldn't give a shit. I would much prefer to see a Doctor Who series, like, just carry on going. Mm-hmm. It's, it, it's been a problem. What, what, what you mean, like, indefinitely, like, a soap opera? Constantly going, yeah. <laughs> Not like that, like, a serialised. EastEnders. Like, have a, an overarching series plot. Like, a lot of episodes, like, Monster of the Week. Mm. Not these two parters, just maybe the odd one, but don't make a series out of two parters. Do you want to go about the, the original New Who format? Where it was yeah, like, like the bad like yeah, yeah, thing. Because yeah, yeah. like, that was really clever when yeah. you go back and watch the episodes. Oh my god, there's like this reference, this reference, this reference. Yeah. It's not just shoehorned in. Yeah, yeah. And, and they're like, you've got some two parters, some aren't. But it was like, it did sort of lose a bit of a stripe when it just went all two parters, or no two parters, and then all two parters. Mm. Um, Oh, that being, that being said, like, like I said, the writing I think has been spotty. Like there was the episode, like first season of Peter Capaldi, where they're on the moon, and the moon's like an egg. But there's also oh, like, God, yeah, there's, there's also there's oh, also yeah. spider oh, germs. I blocked that out. There's also <laughs> spi- there's also spider germs, like like, mon- like monster spiders, and they're like germs or something. And I'm like, this could have been two stories easily. Like the spiders could have been one story, and the moon. Could have been another story, but would there have been uh, strong stories on their own? Mm-hmm. If they could have been divided a bit more, 
Yeah. A bit more thought. Could have, it's like, oh, the moon's hatched into the space thing. Oh, and it's immediately laid an identical moon sized egg. Steven, what are you smoking? Like, what the hell? The moon can't just vanish. Yeah, it's just like this sort of like space dragon y thing that like is hatched out of the moon. That has um, like been alive for what f- five seconds, and it's already laid an egg that was the same size as the egg that it's just <laughs> come out of. It sounds like we've been playing a bit too, far, too much Final Fantasy XIV because that was one of the plot devices when they destroyed the first ship game and start the new one. Was one of the moons came down, exploded, revealed a dragon, which they destroyed the world. Huh. I also liked how nobody seemed to really care that the thing that came out of the egg just like just tootled off. So you get like, oh, this, this is this is a great thing. Welcome to England. Welcome to the moon. Welcome like, to England. Everyone's apathetic here. <laughs> <laughs> this looks a little. Oh, that's gonna make my journey slower, <laughs> isn't it? Oh, I'm so sorry. No, no, no. Ten minutes to get out. What was the voting system that they used again? Was like, oh, um, if you, uh, it was like, all right. And um, if you like, don't want us to blow up the moon, <laughs> keep your lights on. If you do want us to turn them off, and I'm like, only half the world's going to be able. To <laughs> half the world will understand you. Yeah, only half the world's going to, is this going to be and translated into like, the stand- of the world will you be looking at? Yeah, it's like there doesn't seem to be any lights down. Oh, that's the Pacific Ocean, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> but it's nice to see something focused on Europe and the UK as opposed to a series focused on America. Yeah, but like they, they, but, but so also like, like I, I, they, they go overboard on everything's happening in London. Yeah, mm-hmm. there's like like, like you know, Chris Rackles and David Tennant early series, like every other episode's in London. Or it's like, or in London, or modern day London, modern day London, past London, modern day London, past London, future London, <laughs> super future London. <laughs> Actually, super future New York. <laughs> oh, totally oh, in London. The, with the cats. Yeah. Oh, was that New York? Yeah, it was, oh, it was New 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 York. New York. <laughs> Don missed one shit. <laughs> <laughs> then, like, was it modeled after the New York, as in New York, America, or the New York Village, just outside Chimo? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> that actually amused me. Right, we're going to New York. Yeah, you're going to hang on a bit. We've not even left the country. <laughs> we're in New York, though. <laughs> yes, yeah, a small village called New York. <laughs> I, mean, I, I think it actually has been a Doctor Who episode in the north of England, actually. <laughs> It was a, a, a episode. Right, we're on this alien world. We can't understand anything any of them saying. The Geordies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're they're in, they're in Killingworth. Um, so, it's like by enemy. smashing people with bottles. <laughs> yeah, actually, was during the. I, I was going to say was during like uh, set during the era of the Luddite riots, but I'm like that's no different with Friday night, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, uh, no, okay. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, it's coming to three o'clock now, so that's going to have to be us, I think. Mm-hmm. So um, we've been here just about an hour. Um, well, talking just about an hour. Amy still hasn't shown up. Boo. She should be here any second. She's going to be here the whole time, though. <laughs> just quietly staring at Leroy. There you go. And he contemplates how to kill him in the most horrifying way possible. Leroy, the best. <laughs> Amy, man, shut up. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> what, what's yeah, that? Like, yeah, 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 but you're wrong. So. <laughs> I'm a doctor in it. I'm never wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I could be the next doctor that you don't know. Sure. No, no, yeah, no, 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 you don't need to be doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was your be nurse too. <laughs> I made an inappropriate gesture. It sounds like the podcast just travelled back to the 1950s. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to make some hats. Make Is it, that thing you've been sat in the TARDIS this whole time? Yeah. If Clara can have a TARDIS that's the shape of a diner, we can have a TARDIS that's the shape of a library. <laughs> it's bigger on the outside. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, a, that's the thing. We seem to have a thing that's bigger on the outside than it is on the inside. <laughs> well, I've just realised there's a coat standing in the corner. I could have put my coat on. <laughs> Show you know for next time. <laughs> yeah. Now we know. Now we know for next time. We've been, we've been sat recording this for quite a while now, and Greg's literally just noticed. <laughs> yeah, I noticed the kitchen area, but not the. Uh, <laughs> what we could do is hang records up and then just start this again. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Just pay for another hour. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so like uh, that's that's got, that's got to do us for now. So thank you for listening. If indeed there are anybody listening. <laughs> I'm uh, listening. 
Yeah. Comments if you are, just take, prove it. I'm, I'm <laughs> getting tired. Uh, say how good Kufka is in the comments, <laughs> please. We'll know if Amy's listening. Yeah. Yeah. I wish you guys. So it's like, I'm, I'm, I'm always listening. And it's like, where's the tracking device? <laughs> <laughs> it's in the coin, that's where it is. Yeah. Where it is? For the game. Gadget. <laughs> Yeah, there's, a, there's a little switch on it somewhere that you can just flick and turn off. Yeah, there is. I was looking for the tracking device. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's well, been... turning off the tracking device, of course there's a switch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the switch just didn't do anything. It's there for show on the tracking device. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like if you... Um, from the list of what, what is it? Like, if, I, if I become a supervillain, I will do so. Like, one, one was like, oh, if you... Um, if I have like, a console that requires an on-off button, the, on- the button that's labelled on-off will just trigger a spray of bullets <laughs> <laughs> on whoever's stupid enough to press it. Similarly, the self-destruct button will do the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> the on-off switch will be a rocker switch on the side that's not labelled. <laughs> on that cheery yeah. note. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Don't, don't ever piss off Greg. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I know. I, I know. Piss him off. It's funny. Do <laughs> <laughs> <Why> you <laughs> right, So thank you for listening. Uh, the cast this week has been myself, uh, Craig, Sophie, and Leroy, um, and the ghost of Amy, um, who's been haunting us. <laughs> we have channeled her spirit. Yes, we've. We, 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 tiny winter board. Yes. On my phone. Oh, you do actually have a tiny Ouija board. Yes, you do have a tiny Ouija board. You know where it keeps, keeps going from C L A R K I L L C L. Yeah, I, I, I know. So I thought you were just making it up. I know you do actually have a tiny Ouija board on your phone. Of course, you has got a Ouija board. Is that just for when your phone dies? Yeah. Oh God! End it! End it! End it! <laughs> Great closing joke, but not, not prolong it anymore. <laughs> <laughs>